Good morning, this is Pastor Lynn from the Goodland United Methodist Church. Do you know what the letters in the word golf stand for? Golf, G-O-L-F, Game of Life First. I invite you this morning to the book of Joshua and the first chapter, beginning with verse 5 through 9. I will be with you in the same way I was with Moses. I won't desert you or leave you, Jesus said. Be brave and strong, because you are the one who will help this people take possession of the land, which I have pledged to give to their ancestors. Be strong and courageous, as you carefully obey all the instructions that Moses, my servant, commanded you. Do not deviate even a bit from it, either to the right or to the left. Then you will have success wherever you go. Never stop speaking about this instruction scroll. Recite it day and night as you can carefully obey everything written in it. When you will accomplish your objectives and you will succeed, then I have commanded you to be strong and courageous, haven't I? Don't be alarmed or terrified because the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. There's some words that come about over and over in this passage. Be strong and courageous, for I have commanded you to be strong and of good courage and not to be fearful. As Tom Lehman prepared for the round open, final round of the 1996 U.S. Open at Oakland Hills in Birmingham, Michigan, he read Joshua 1.9, which speaks of being strong and courageous. This passage of scripture was just the inspiration he needed for that final round in which he paired with his friend, Steve Jones. As Tom and Steve walked down the first fairway, they prayed, and they spoke about truths they had learned from passages in Joshua. They reminded themselves of God's promise in verse 8, For then you shall make your way prosperous, and then you shall have good success. This verse was what they needed throughout the day as they battled the challenges and the pressures that only the final round of a major can bring. Although they were competing against each other for the U.S. Open title, when Steve hit his tee shot into the woods on the 16th hole, Tom encouraged him by reminding him that the Lord wants us to be strong and courageous. For Tom, it would have been very easy to see this as an opportunity to prevail against his friend rather than to encourage him. For Steve, it would have been easy to falter, but instead he persevered and he did not become discouraged. Although Steve won the U.S. Open title that day, both men experienced God's encouragement. And from this experience, they were reminded that they didn't need to be frightened or dismayed because strength and courage could always be theirs if they continually went to the right source. While God promises to make our way prosperous and successful, it does not mean we will win every championship or succeed in every situation. What it does mean is this, it's that way in golf and it's that way in life. This is Pastor Lynn. Have a great day.